next 72 hours just non-stop getting content, following a day in the life of the board. Um, and so we're going to see how much, how much do I really do? We're going to get to the bottom of it right now. How much does Nathan Walker really do in 72 hours? So much bags. <laughs> like realistically, that's something that the second he says he's ready to roll, we send that fucking contract. Yeah, that's that yeah. second, yeah. So check out these things. Ready for Vegas? Fucking ready. Let's do it. Nathan Walker goes hard, man. He goes hard in the paint. We're going to the hospital to visit him. He uh, might have outstretched himself a little bit yesterday. He's getting some relaxation time in the hospital. So we're going to head over there, make sure he's OK. He'll be out of there soon, and we'll get uh, back to our trip. Oh, he's 
to follow now, huh? He just woke up, 2 a.m. He had like a bunch of numbness on the left side of his body. It was really hard to breathe. Another question. Can I leave now? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, nice. <laughs> nice little wax job. <laughs> Drooling. So we're out in Vegas, uh, beautiful Las Vegas this week at the Lightspeed offices here. Um, we're filming and recording our second course in the level of VT platform. This is Small Business Mastery. Um, Nathan just finished up all the videos um, a couple hours ago. Took a lot of hard work to get here, a lot of writing, a lot of scripting, a lot of, uh, a lot of stuff went into this, but now that it's where it's at, uh, this is the real fun part because Lightspeed can kind of just work their magic, so we're super excited. Nathan Walker in the house, folks. Nathan Walker from Level Up. What up? Now, here's the crazy part. He flew in yesterday and damn near fucking lost his life. It's a true story, man. I woke up at 2.15 and was just like, dude, my body was like just numb. I, I thought I was, I'm diabetic also. Almost like you like you slept on your leg. Yeah, kind of like that. Like I was, uh... Have dude, you ever slept on your arm and woke up? And yeah, it, dead? dude, I've slept on my arm and then tried to raise it and then... It, fell on my face. That's a weird feeling when your own arm falls on your face yeah, like that, you know? Weird. But it was it was weirder than that though because it wasn't even just that my leg was not, it wasn't like that. It was more like uh my body was my head was weird. Dude, everything about it was just it was just a weird deal and uh But you came out of it. You went to the hospital. Came out of it, man. You woke up, you couldn't move, you felt like you were in mud. Yeah. No, the I mean, so they I mean, I did tests all day yesterday. I did CAT scans, MRI. Basically they said, "Man, you're uh you need to you need to probably take a little bit of, a little bit of time, you know, so going you, a little too hard. <laughs> so you just basically collapsed. You were exhausted. Yeah. Was it a stroke or no? It was. Uh, it was not an actual stroke. No. But, but I, similar to what? But it was the symptoms of a stroke. They called it a mini stroke. Which basically means you're you're grinding too hard. Grinding too hard. See what I tell you, people. You don't have to grind your face off to make you just be said successful. that too. You just said that. I just said it on the last episode or two. Yep. You don't have to grind your face off. Think about something. Why would you grind so hard that you don't get to hang with your kids and you basically collapse in a Las Vegas hotel room and have to get... You know how cool you feel? You, you know how cool you feel on a stretcher going out the Mandalay Bay? You know what I mean? Looking at 2 like in the morning? When everyone... Dick. You know, and you know what everyone thinks, too. When you're when you're getting wheeled out of your room, you oh, they just think you're fucking you hammered. Yeah, they, they think you... <laughs> Well, there you have it. I mean, look, 72 hours, I even didn't realize how crazy it is. Um, the reality is, is we got the work done. Um, you know, we got what we what we wanted to accomplish done, but I'll be honest with you, I left. Uh, I'm coming out of this with a little different perspective. Look, I gotta, I gotta, I have to take care of myself a little bit here. I realize that maybe sometimes, maybe I'm going just a little too hard and maybe I need to listen to my body a little bit when it's telling me that I need to pump the brakes a little bit. But look, hey, we got the job done. Uh, we got some great content. It was a good time. I'm back at it. I'm going to still go hard, but I'm going to make sure that I'm around for my babies and I'm around for uh, a lot more time left on this earth.